Now that we've chosen our template for the thank you page, let's go ahead and edit the page. Okay, let's start from the top here. You could insert a logo here if you have one. So you could just click here and you could just upload your image here. But for now, I'm going to delete this since we don't have a logo. So it says here, wait, your purchase is not complete. Please follow the steps below to complete your purchase. So usually what I would do, step one, I would say something like, check your email. And then in the description here, let's just delete this here. I'll just tell them to check their inbox. Here, let me just type it down here. Please, please check your inbox folder and your spam folder. Click on the confirm button to ensure that you receive future updates. So I would say something like this. I don't have the text right now that I usually put, but it would be somewhere along the lines of this, where you ask the customer to check their email and to confirm their subscription and to ensure that they have the correct email address on our database so that they could receive future updates for this product. Okay. And then step number two, it could be anything here. You could, for this demo, let's just say download your product. Okay. And then you could type down whatever you want here. You could also put a link right here to the download file. Okay. You could also put it here on the button and you could also edit this button. It says button text here. So instead of saying click here to register, you could say click here to download or to activate, whatever you want to say. And then edit the action. So what's the action you want when they click on the button? And again, you could put a link to the file wherever it is. And for now, let's just click save. And now step three, if you don't have anything to say, you could just delete this. So let's just delete step three. And step four, it says check your email. I've already gone through that. So we're just going to delete this as well. Sometimes I have as many as five or more steps on here. But for this demonstration, I'm just going to show you the two steps that you could put on your thank you page. So let's delete this. And there you go. Now my funnel is complete. I hope you've enjoyed watching the videos and learning from them. And if you watched all these videos, you can see how easy it is to use click funnels. There's not much of a learning curve. So I wish you the best of luck and uh, have fun creating your funnels.